everybody! Welcome back to Trash or Treasure! Got my special guest here, Tata. This is what he has to say. What? I picked this up recently. I guess there's like a K-pop character from a band or something. But he is just the cutest little thing. I love him so much. So I just wanted to show him off because... I don't really have many places to show them off, so here you go. <laughs> now, for those of you who are here for Trash or Treasure, thank you and welcome back. And for those who don't even know what Trash or Treasure is and you clicked on this and you're like, well, I want a piece of this action because of course you do, Trash or Treasure is where I took all of my old Steam keys, yeah, sometimes even new Steam keys of games that I've never before played. I mean, or like less than, I think 15 minutes was my stipulation. So like six minutes or like two minutes, like, you know. So I put them all in a games to try folder on this massive spreadsheet here too. So that... We could pick a random number between 1 and 24 today to see what game we get to play 30 minutes of that game and to decide at the end whether or not it is trash or treasure. There's a middle category called trash as well for the ones that are not quite garbage but not quite a gem either. So we are picking between one and 124 today and I guess we'll just go right ahead and see what we get but 50 all right then number 50 what is that gonna be scrolling up, 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 up. Oh! I know some people are gonna be real happy that I got this. I know somebody wanted this one to be pulled. Psychonauts. I have heard good things. This this sounds good. How do I spell it? Psy. There we go. So in the game's a try folder, Psychonauts. Here we go. Let's install it. Oh my goodness, this is a big game. <laughs> Looks like I'm going to be waiting for a little bit, but that is okay. I've got Tata here to keep me company while I wait, and I will see you guys when it is ready to play. Alright, we're back, and like magic, I'm up in this little corner with my gloves, because it's cold in here. <laughs> so, we are about to play 30 minutes of Psychonauts. Uh, of course, not all videos are 30 minutes long or longer. Sometimes if the game, I know, is really boring <laughs> or nothing's going on, I'll chop it down to save your life. But, uh... Yeah, we're going to just jump right into it and see what Psychonauts is all about. Ah, I forgot about this. <laughs> it's like when you go and put a new game in the PlayStation. It's like, let us do all our installations. One second, guys. <laughs> I might need to turn the it down. human mind. 600 miles of synaptic fiber. Five and a half ounces of cranial fluid. 1,500 grams of complex neural matter. A three-pound pile of dreams. Hey. But I'll tell you what it really is. It is the ultimate battlefield. And the ultimate weapon. The wars of this modern age, the psychic age, are all fought somewhere between these damp, curvaceous undulations. <laughs> Got From a this brain day fetish. Forward, you are all psychic soldiers, paranormal paratroopers, mental marines who are about to ship out on the adventure of their lives. This is our beachhead. And this is your landing craft. 
You shall engage the enemy in his own mentality. You shall chase his dreams. You shall fight his demons. You shall live his nightmares. And those of you who fight well, you will find yourselves on the path to becoming international secret agents. In other words, psychonauts. Woo. The rest of you will die. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Maury. Children, you are not going to die. Well, if you're not a psycho knot, then you might as well be dead. <laughs> they told me this was a summer camp. Ah, <laughs> oh, Dogen. Don't worry about old Coach Oleander. I've been coming here for years, and trust me, nothing ever happens. Yeah, Dogen. Lily's right. You don't got nothing to worry about. Uh-huh. Except for that giant monster in the lake Ew. I was telling you about. Brush your Bobby teeth. Zilch, I told you to stop scaring people with that ridiculous old legend. I don't want the kids to be afraid to go out at night and walk alone on the perfectly safe paths of Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp. And we don't want to scare our special guests. Superstar Psychonaut Sasha Nine and Mia Vodello. Whoa! Light monster! Formation. It's resisting. Quick, bring it over here. Is it? It's just a little boy. What's your name, darling? I'll find out. Get! Get! In! Ugh. My name... Starts with a D. ...is Rasputin. <laughs> but everybody calls me... Raz. Oh. Please don't kill us! Compelling. Armored like a tank! Sorry I'm late. I don't want to disrupt your briefing, Agent Oleander. Agents 9, Vodello, please, continue. Where do you think you're going? You've broken into a highly classified remote government training facility. I know. Isn't it great? Listen, why don't I just sit over here quietly with my fellow psychedets? Hey, how's it going? I like your hat. We need to have this young man taken from here immediately. I'll call his parents. What? But don't you train psychonauts here? Yes, darling, but... To soar across the astral plane. To wage psychic warfare against the enemies of free thought. That is what I wrote on the front of the pamphlet. Those words are why I'm here, Coach Oleander. Do you remember what you wrote on the inside of that pamphlet? You were born with a special gift. But the people around you treat it like a curse. Your mother is afraid of you. And your father looks at you with shame in his eyes. Come to Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp, and you can show them all. Back home, your powers make you a loner, an outcast, a circus freak. But in this dojo, in this psychic dojo, they make you a hero. He memorize it? Get that soldier a bunk. Now, darling, you can stay here for a few days until your parents come for you, but we can't let you participate in any paranormal training without your parents' consent. I'm sorry. Wowie, you're so lucky. You get to go home soon. Home? Back there, I was just like you were, Dogen. Punished by my own family for having powers I never asked for. But here, I have a chance to be something. To make a difference. They may come for me, Dogen. But they'll be looking for Raz, the boy. What they're going to find? 
What they don't expect is Raz, the Psychonaut. And, and, and then you'll make their heads explode? No. Do you do that? No. Well, once, kinda. But now I wear this special hat. Wanna try it on? No, no, no. But he has mental defenses like I've never seen in someone so young. If I could just get him in my lab for some experiments, I'm sure he could withstand more than the others. That kid's one in a million, Nine. But I'm not gonna let you turn him into one of your guinea pigs. I've got big plans for that mind. Okay. I hope this is good enough sound wise because we're just gonna we're just winging it it's been a long time since I've done a trash of treasure well I don't want to be with the crying kid sure uh, pick nickname okay I'll be Carl's I'm gonna All move right, this. Down in here. Big day tomorrow. I want to see each and every one of you runs in my classroom at 0600 hours on the dot. I'm the early bird, and you're the worms. Got it? Now, lights out! Lights out, kitties. Okay, quick eye exam before we start. Huh? Look over that way if you will. Wow, what's that? Oh, that's a side challenge marker. The staff scatters these all over the camp to test the students. Every one of these you find advances you a whole rank. Looks like one of those uh, monster rancher things. Up, up there. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Some of the old markers have fallen apart. You'll find bits of them flapping around loose. If you find enough of these side cards, you can put them together to make a brand new challenge marker. But you have to buy a side core at the camp store to hold them together. Keep ranking up, and before you know it, you'll be able to use brand new psychic powers. Stuff you didn't even know you could do. And then when do I become a psychonaut? Because I have to do that before my dad shows up to take me home. Hey, where'd he go? That guy looks so familiar. <laughs> Change cam preferences, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Hey, Raz! Hurry up! You don't want to be late for basic braining! Woohoo! Basic braining is the best class ever! Woohoo! Right. I want this. All right. Congratulations. Who's this? You know that cabin is empty, right? Duh. I'm practicing for tonight when it's gonna be full of ladies. <laughs> that kind of thing takes practice. Um, excuse me, but my parents let me watch R-rated movies, so I think I know a little bit more about this than you do, okay? Oh. Oh! That has got to be the worst band name I have ever heard. The Whispering Rockers. Oh, uh, what? That's my band name idea. Why aren't you guys in Coach Oleander's class? Are you kidding? A kid got killed in that class last year. I heard it was a bunch of kids, Phoebe. Well, I heard it was a bunch of blind kids, and the coach threw them off a cliff. Yeah, because they were late for class. <laughs> You'd better hurry, kid. Now, where were we, Quinn? And by worst, did you possibly mean Stupid the best? Lame. Because that's, that's what, what I was thinking. No, I meant worst, as in I can't even believe we're friends. It's hey, so hey, it's this guy. I'm telling you for the last time, no. Those are some creepy squirrels. Kill everyone. Oh, hi, Raz. Squirrel trouble? The wires is off. Whatever they 
tell you. It's a lie. I'll take your word for it. You going to class? Yeah. I'll meet you up there. As soon as I get these guys to shut up. Shut up! Oops. Yeah, shut up. Shut I'm up. Sorry. I am not. Yeah. Not there you go. I wouldn't! You going to class? Yeah. I'll meet you up there. As soon as I get these guys to shut up. I did. I shut them up. I hit them all. How he did? Pretty sure I handled it. Hey, what happened to the squirrels? They lied. They lied, and then, then, then they they left. Okay, if you say so. All right, let's just go. I don't know why it's highlighting the the right click, because that doesn't do anything. At least it's not doing anything for me. It's cute. Q and e. e. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll gain something on there. Try sliding down the handrail. Woo! Nice. Sweet. Balance. I did not, I did not see what it said. Swing. How do I get up? Surfaces. Covered and netting. Can we climb? All right, let's get up the... Screw class. Alright, F to pull up. Got an arrowhead. Okay, it's rare mineral. Makes it valuable. You can buy items with it. Okay. Oh! I did not want to do that, but we're doing it. We're sliding. Hey. Frozen solid. Really? Frozen solid. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Clearly nothing here for us. Nope. Nope. More money and a card. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, money everywhere. I can move it, so maybe I can pick it up somehow. Oh, wait. Nope. Okay, whatever. I guess now it's time to go to class. We're gonna be late and he's gonna be mad. Hey, where are you going, Maloof? Shh, I snuck out. That class is a death trap for crazy people. Listen, the coach is strong. At the start of class, he pulls you into his mind, and then there's nothing you can do about it. Once you're in, you can use these smelling salts to sneak out. Take mine. I don't need them anymore. I'm calling my parents to come get me before I get hurt. 
Too late! Bobby! Ah! Hey, kid! You owe me five arrowheads for this week's protection service! Cough it up, my loser! Police. Or you'll be coughing up bloody tears! Hey, leave him alone! I heard a rumor that you were raised in the circus! Well, let me put this in terms you'll understand! I'm the strong man around here! Uh huh. Really? Because you look more like the cotton candy. <laughs> Benny, put this kid back on my to do list! Come on, we'll see him in class. Yeah, we'll settle this on the battlefield! Journal's a great place to see what you've done. Okay, you can use it to save and load, change options, there's a map. Press escape to open it, okay. You can use arrow keys to the mouse. You've collected. Page shows how you're doing. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, mental vault, store memories. Mm -hmm. That's probably like the beginning. I don't want to click on it just in case. It's handy map, your position is this. Place you need to go is this. Pretty much there. <laughs> All right, we're good. They see Nall being a trance while they astrally project themselves. In. They see Nall being a trance while they astrally project themselves into the coach's sight. The Which coach uses this to broadcast his thoughts across the camp. I think I can tune it to reach my people in space. Funky, all right. I'm ready. Coach Oleander, I'm reporting for basic braining. Son, do you realize that to take my course, I will have to pull you into my mind, and you will have to relive every bullet-scarred memory of every battle I have ever faced. It won't be pretty. Are you sure you wouldn't rather run around a bit more in the sunshine first? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm ready, sir. Well then, you're late, soldier. Now get in here and give me twenty. All right, going inside his brain. So, this is it. The mental world. It looks like a dentist office. A mental dentist office. A mentist office. Oh. It's a recruiting office, kids. And I'm here to recruit you for the greatest job in the world. Being a psychonaut. It's about fighting a war for mental freedom. Are you ready to face torture, insanity, and death? Because this is your last chance to chicken out. Oh, me, sir. I'd like to chicken out, please. <laughs> Too late, soldier. But you said... There's only one way out of here. Fighting. Not true. I want one of you chickens to sock me square in a jaw. I warn you, once you do, the war is on. You're not... Ah, that's what I'm talking about. What kind of obstacle course is this? That kid just got killed! A mental obstacle course. Bleeding heart. He's not dead. His astral projection just got kicked out of my mind. And I'll kick your astral projection out of here too if you don't get moving right now! You're like molasses going uphill in January! With crutches! Oh. Oh no! Messed up already. 
That's the double jump. Get me out of here. There we go. It's darker on my screen than it is over there. Here we go. Relax. That's just a figment of my imagination. You can run right through figments. They help you rank up, and when you rank up, you earn new psychic powers. Nice. So whenever you see a figment, suck it up, soldier. Come on, get that figment. All right, a hundred, you'll be promoted. Get all the figments in your journal. Yeah, I'm looking for the figment. Oh, where's Figment? Here we go. This guy, although he was red. That's it. I thought, <laughs> I thought it was gonna like I don't know, have a story or something. Hey, piggy, who's coaches, little piggy? Hey, what are you staring at? We all have emotional baggage, kid. Why don't you make yourself useful? <laughs> sort some of it out while you're in here. Keep your eyes peeled for a tag that matches. Could be anywhere. Can I hit it? No. It's game day, kid! There it is! Now, you will pick up that tag and you will put it on that bag you just found! Unless you'd rather just drop and give me 20 right now! Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, he's so happy. Less waiting, more motivating. You hit that ladder hard, son. Show it who's boss. Got another suitcase. Mount the pole. Watch out! Fire down below! Alright, I'm gonna fix my computer screen for a second. I have my shadow control too low. We can't get past this! This is stupid! Hmm. Looks like a test. There's probably a secret, more advanced route. What's that supposed to mean? You think you're more advanced than me, new kid? Sorry, what? I'm not stupid. You're stupid. The coach is stupid. The whole camp is stupid. That thing flying at you is stupid. What's flying at me? Whoa! <laughs> Bobby jumps his foot. That's what? You stupid new kid. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Thanks for saving me. Well, actually, I was saving this plant. Huh. Never seen one so meaty before. I have. It's been appearing in this creepy nightmare I keep having. You're having nightmares? Oh, I've been reading about how to fix those. Will you let me see one? Hmm. No. <laughs> what happened to Bobby? Oh, whatever. I'm gonna go and get these. Beep. All right. Less waiting, more motivating! Yep. 
Alright, here we go. Bop. Anywhere else I can go? Mm -hmm. That totally looked more phallic from the side. Time. Is your name Joey? No. Cause I'm gonna call you Slowy Joey. That's not my name. What was that, Slowy? I can't hear ya. You. You're talking too slow. <laughs> <laughs> so mean to the kids. All right. Get these figments, so shut up. Now that kind of wall, you can climb it up, down, sideways, whatever way you want. Just get on it. Quick, nice. like a monkey. Ooh, okay. Help you? Uh, Follow me. I'll help you through the mines. Okay. Yeah, follow me, Dogan. I can't do it. I can't do it. Yes, you can, Dogan. Just follow me. Okay. I can't do it. I can't do it. Come on. Oh my god. You got me killed, Dogan. I'm gonna get these stupid things first. Whoop. I wonder if you can, like, just die infinitely. Oh no, I got five lives, apparently. Okay, come on. Yes, you can, Dogan. Just follow me. Okay. I can't do it. I can't do it. Yes, yes you, you can. can. Dogen, just follow me. Okay. I can't do it. 
I can't do it. Oh my it. god, you're like right there. Yes, you can, Dogen. Just follow me. Okay. See, you did I it. I can't do it. I yes, you can, Dogen. Just follow me. Okay. Ah, oh, I missed it. Less waiting, more motivating! Hey, look, Raz! I didn't explore at all! Good hustle out there. What's that? Psychic arrowhead. First draw energy contributes to the owl. I think you'll find they add up over time. Okie doke. Now what? Save. I guess I should. Mentalis Uberalis. Yeah, I got it. All right, now I'm gonna save. Okay, we'll save now. Cause it'll tell me how long I've been playing for. Okay. Everybody's then talking at right. once. And then we turned a soft right. And then we turned a deep left. And then we took a side road. And then we stopped and asked for directions. Oh my god. And then Lady had to go to the bathroom. And then Lady saw a gopher. And then Lady had to stop and scratch. And then I bent down to tie my shoe. And then we walked three miles. And then we walked two miles. And then we walked four miles. Oh my god. And then we walked half a mile. And then we made a U-turn. Oh my god, let me get away from him. And then Lady saw a gopher. And then I gave Lady a bone. <laughs> And he's still saying it. That's pretty funny. Oh, I died. Thought maybe I could jump on the wing or something. I didn't die. I'm supposed to do that. Hey, look! It's Raz! Yay! Raz is here! Maybe you'll be able to beat this darn game. We can't do it. Yeah, we're no good. And the coach won't open the gate until someone wins. Yay, Raz! Just punch that to start. Okay, I want to get the figments first. You score enough points on this course, kid, and I'll give you a reward. Okay, points needed 20, 60 seconds. Punch! Hooray! Yay, Rez! Punch! Hooray! Punch, punch, punch! Punch, punchy, punch, punch! Hey, good job, soldier. Now here's your reward. Opening the gate. <laughs> Alright then. Most people, they got something to hide. They store away their shame, their dirty little secrets, these tiny vaults in their minds. But the enemy has not allowed any secrets in wartime, are they, soldier? So go ahead and bust open this vault. I got nothing to hide. Ah, good. Yeah. Orleander's pride. This was him in the old days, I guess. That's you cool. enjoy that. One of my favorites. 
We did enjoy your memory, thank you. Oh, guy can teleport you. We absorbed some positive mental health. Maintaining your mental health is important. If you run out, you won't be able to maintain astral protection in this mind. Okay. <laughs> so I absorbed some mental health and I gave a thing. Run, bunny! Run, bunny! <laughs> Go. Yeah, I died for that. At least I got the figment. Let's go. that guy. Alright, camera relax. <laughs> okay, let's see. Completed another. All right, I want to see a little bit longer. We've hit the 30 minute mark. It's got me. save it there leave it at that last comment all right everybody that was 52 minutes apparently i played 52 minutes of psychonauts a bunch of it was cut scenes but that is totally okay it gives you a nice um nice bit of flavor there for what the game is all about and i gotta say that i really quite enjoyed it i didn't really know what to expect 
Um, I thought it was going to be, like, really childish, but it wasn't. <laughs> it's totally fine. You kids at this kind of psychic summer camp, and you're the, you're going to be the best one, obviously. You got yourself very motivated to do so before your dad comes to pick you up from summer camp. I'm interested to see where it goes. The platforming was totally okay. Only a few, um annoyances I would say with the camera angle you know you can move and then everything will kind of like obstruct your view for a second so there was that but all in all voice acting was fun the game itself was fun it was interesting <laughs> so that means we are taking it out of the games to try folder and it might be obvious to some what this one is going to be, but bing, it is going into the treasure folder. Yeah. All right, let's take Psychonauts off the list. I'm going to do this in video so I don't ever forget and mess it up. I have a couple of new Steam keys to add to the games to try folder so uh, you never know next time the list will be probably a little bit longer we're trying to trim it down and it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger it is the <laughs> list that never ends <laughs> so every week probably around Wednesday on my Twitter I'll put a thing and a link and everything so you can get to it. I will be posting Trash or Treasure game lists so everybody can, you know, pick a number to see what number they want. And who knows, maybe your number will get picked and I will play the respective game for that. So if you want to get join in on all the fun that we're having over there on Twitter, to have fun over here on YouTube, then get on my Twitter. I will see you there. Thank you for spending time with me. And I hope you enjoyed this Trash or Treasure. If you end up picking up Psychonauts and giving it a whirl for yourself, let me know. Or if you've played it before, let me know down in the comments below what you thought of it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. I fell down a bad hole and had to reset my old arm back in the socket. And then we just stood still for a while. And then we made a U-turn. And then we walked half a mile. And then I bent down to tie my shoe. And then 